Welcome back to Google Guru. Our next video in our series about five things you may not know about Google Calendars involves the Calendar Labs and I'm just going to introduce you to that and then I'm going to walk you through a couple of labs that I like to use for my calendars. So to access labs, you're going to open up your calendars, click on the gear on the right hand side of your page and select labs. So this will take you to the Calendar Labs page where you can test out some of the features that Google isn't quite ready to release to Google Calendars. By enabling these you can test them out for your Google Calendar and then somewhere along the line they might be adopted permanently by Google or they may be retired before they even get released. So I want to show you a few of my favorite labs that I like to use. So one of them is Event Attachments, so I'm going to enable that, and the other is Next Meeting. These are pretty self-explanatory, but I'm going to walk you through exactly what they do. So after you enable the lab that you want to use, scroll down to the bottom and click Save, and this will take you back to your calendar page. So right away you can see exactly what Next Meeting does. It opens up a window on the right-hand side of your page, highlighting the next meeting in your calendar. So as you can see, an hour and a half from now, I have a metrics review in the Guru office. So. This is just a really handy tool that makes it a lot easier to navigate your calendar, especially when it gets pretty crowded. Mine's not too crowded right now, but if you have a crowded calendar, it makes it a lot easier to quickly see what you have up next. So we're going to take a look at event attachments next. So as you can see, tomorrow is the first, so I want to set up a monthly budget review. So I'm going to start an event and title that monthly budget review. I'm going to add my accounting group to that. And that I'd also like for everyone that's attending the event to have the copy of our monthly budget ready with them when they come to the meeting. So to do that, I'm going to click, go down here and select Add Attachment, and then select Monthly Budget, and apply that to this event. You need to make sure that everyone who is attending the meeting has permission to view the document, or else, like always, they won't be able to open it. So then I'm going to save this event. And then we're just going to go take a look back at the event again. And as you can see, there's the monthly budget right there. This is what my other guests will see when they open up this event page. And so by clicking on the document, it'll open up to the spreadsheet. So that's about all I have for you today. Just a quick look into a couple of my favorite Google Calendar labs. Um, I hope that was helpful for you guys. Stay tuned for the next few videos in our series about the top five things you may not know about Google Calendars. As always, Please leave us a message in the comments section below if you have any questions or ideas for new videos. Thanks.